Hi, I'm Stephen Danaluti from Net Society, and I'm going to take you through a live demo um, on how to create ideas, essentially implement them as projects, and generally build knowledge around these ideas. First of all, we'll add an idea, and we'll do that by just clicking the button on the left. Add your title, very simple one, um, and then a quick description of of your idea. Save button next automatically create a page on our site you can then immediately add a comment um, embellish on the idea and the intention is to as the idea suggested to get users to do this um, it can be around any topic of course there you have your comment um, I then just go to the ideas landing page you can see that some ideas have already been created I can rate this idea it automatically gets registered if I click back on the idea um, we'll go back to where we were a moment ago, and you can see that I can edit the idea through our action button. Very simple, really. Um, if you have a look at uh, just the one field below the open editor is the status. You can take an idea through different stages. Just cancel that for the moment. Um, the other things you can do is change your vote afterwards, and that's, of course, only you, the person that's logged in. So very quickly on to projects now, I'll take you through one project we've already created. You can see here that I can edit the project. Again, it's just a page, a wiki page essentially. I can add a task. All projects are managed through tasks. I click on the task section and you can see that there are two tasks associated with this project. I look at the one task and um, here it is. You can see again that there's certain parameters. If I edit the page, you'd see that you could change that, the reporter, the assignee, etc. And you can comment on task elements, um, and all of this is uh, sent to you in notifications via email. Final section is knowledge, and um, here you can see that we have a, a page again, similar to projects and ideas, and uh, you can edit the page. We have a rich text editor here. You can add widgets through that. You can enable comments and manage permissions at the bottom over here. I'll just cancel that for the moment. And uh, you can add, you can see different versions of that page. You can add attachments to a page. And you can add pages, child or sibling pages, very simply. Final section is our blog section. This is a standard blog function, um, much like any other. And um, here you can add a blog post. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for your time.